in 2016. This is going to be my first video of 2016. I have been on a short hiatus because it has been so nice to kind of not have to worry about work or worry about YouTube and just enjoy my family. I am back now and I have my 2016 favorites for hair products. I'm breaking this up into kind of like three categories. So I wrote stuff down on my phone to make sure that I stay on a nice list. But I'm going to have a styling category, a hair care, which means like shampoo, conditioner, and then a tool category. So these are products that I've used for the past year. I may have previously used them in other years, but they really stood out to me this past year. And I feel like you're going to get your best hair with these. Now I kind of have different products for different hair types or things, so I'll just jump into all of that and let you guys know. It's gonna be kind of a quick overview of the things that I love, but guys, I'm telling you, I am so picky with my hair products. They need to be able to do a lot of wonderful things to your hair and keep your hair healthy, especially as a professional stylist. I use almost all of this in the salon for my clients, and I recommend this to my clients as well. So it's really important for me to share stuff that I've been absolutely loving. I know that works really, really well, and depending on your hair type, I've got something for you in that in that group of products right there, for sure. Okay, let's get started. I don't have them all with me because some of these I've used up and I need to repurchase or I've kind of switched up, so I'm just going to kind of start and then go through my list. So for everyday basis, I start with styling products for my hair. I don't use very heavy products because I have wavy texture um, and I have about, I mean I have I have thicker hair. So now it's all up in a bun because I'm getting my hair done today. Ah, I'm so excited. I need to get highlights for real and a haircut for real. And I might be doing something else to my hair. Okay, so my top two styling products that I use every single day, no matter what I'm doing, are going to be by Moroccan Oil. Um, this first one is the Smoothing Lotion. Now, this is a newer product to their line. I think it came out about a year, two years ago, something like that. But this is a Smoothing Lotion. It's a Blow Dry Essential. This, I gotta tell you guys, fine hair to thick, coarse, crazy hair, this is what you need. We sell out of this at the salon so fast, it's ridiculous. So this is super nourishing. It has argan oil, argan butter, vitamin E, and fatty acids that leave the hair touchably soft and smooth and manageable. It's a lightweight formula with medium hold that provides definition and tames frizz while resisting humidity. So let me just tell you what this little thing does for me. Smooths my hair, takes away frizz, works against humidity, it also has a heat styling protectant in it and it holds, helps to hold your style all throughout the day. So this is basically like everything that you need in one. Other than your like texture styling type stuff, which is when you actually finish dry your hair, this little guy is absolutely incredible. You apply it to damp hair and it's amazing. Now this one, everyone should know about. This is the Moroccan oil treatment. Um, I have light because I have light colored hair, so if you have blonde hair, it's better to use the light because the traditional regular formula actually has kind of an amber color and it could possibly make your hair brassier. So note to self. Um, this is argan oil. It's a very lightweight oil. I love, love, love this. Now if you have finer hair, you use a tiny bit. If you have thicker hair, you can use a full pump. I actually cocktail mine together. So I do a pump of this and then a pump of this. I mix it all together and then I put it in my hair and it is a dream team. Keeps my hair healthy and shiny and absolutely beautiful. So those guys are my must haves. Like I cannot style my hair without them. So this is one of my, this is like one of my holy grail products. Um, I got sent some Living Proof products. I did kind of like a little PR blog post about it. You guys can check it out. I'll leave a link down below of all the products that I tried out. I also did where I like blow dry my hair using Living Proof and it was amazing. Their line is really wonderful. Um, but this one right here, I will always have it in my collection, especially with this haircut that I have, my like lob haircut. This is the Instant Texture Mist. It is a texturizer for drier, damp hair. It gives you the most beautiful separation to your hair. I mean, I'll see if I can throw up a picture of me having this in my hair, but oh my gosh, if you love that like really beautiful textured type of style, but you don't want to put like a sea salt in your hair, which might dry out your hair, guys, 
This is the best thing ever. This, I would probably have to say, my absolute favorite styling product of 2016. Right here, ding, 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 waiter. I mean, it's amazing. I absolutely love it so much. Okay, so to finish up styling products, I wanna talk about dry shampoo. I'm super picky about my dry shampoos. This video is probably gonna be so long. Um, a good, what makes a good dry shampoo? What makes a good dry shampoo? Something that's going to soak up your oils and make your hair look and, and feel clean when you touch it. Some don't do that. Now, if you look at the ingredients on the back of your bottle and it says that it has a rice starch base to it, you have a good dry shampoo that's gonna make your hair clean. Let me see if I can just pull that up. So I don't know if you guys can see, like right in here, it says a rice starch base. That is what makes a really good dry shampoo. Uh, zooming, thank you. Um, I am obsessed with Batiste dry shampoos. This floral essence scent is my favorite, and then also the tropical one is my favorite. They work so good, and they make your hair feel and look clean, and it smells good. And this is my absolute top one. You can find this at Ulta. The other one that I love so much is by Moroccan Oil. Um, this is their new dry shampoo. Um, I think it came out last year, so 2015. And I have a light tone, so it has kind of like a purpley tint to it. You might be able to see it on the nozzle right there. But their dry shampoo is a rice starch base, and it's incredible. And also, it goes into your hair really well. If you have dark hair, what's cool is they have one for dark hair. So if you're tired of that like super white contrasty powder at your roots, get the Moroccan oil and get the dark or get the light and it's gonna match perfect. If you're using a dry shampoo that has an aluminum base, sorry, but you have a bleh, dry shampoo. In my opinion, I will not use aluminum based dry shampoos because they do not do crap for my hair. So last one of the styling products category is a hairspray. Now I obviously love to do a lot of styling and stuff and I need a good working spray. Evo's Builder Paradise, you guys would have seen me use this in almost every single one of my videos. This is a super flexible hairspray that works for all hair types and it keeps in curls for girls that don't have really good holding curls. It works amazing and it doesn't get hard or gross. It's a beautiful hairspray whether you're wearing your hair straight or curly or whatever have you an updo. It's an incredible hairspray and it's my favorite. All right, so hair care products. This is gonna be shampoo, conditioner, masks, that type of stuff. So my number one right here that I have first is going to be by Redken. This is a really great affordable price for a professional shampoo and conditioner line. Um, the All Soft is my absolute favorite from um, Redken. I just feel like this one works so well. It's great for dry, brittle hair. Whether you have um, fine to very coarse hair, this line has it for you. Now because I have more of a medium texture and I have a lot of it and it's very lightened, I use their mask. So they have a shampoo, conditioner, and mask. They also have styling products, but I'm talking about the hair care specifically. Um, if you have a finer texture of hair, I would get the shampoo and conditioner. If you have a thicker or very color processed hair, I would get the shampoo and mask. These guys have argan oil in it, they have a protein network, they have keratin, um, omegas, they're just absolutely amazing, amazing hair products and I have never heard of anyone not liking this shampoo and conditioner because it's so awesome for your hair. I recommend this to people all the time and this mask is like my saving grace. It puts so much moisture into your hair and I love it. This is actually what I'm currently using right now. So the other shampoo that I love, and you guys would have seen this in some of my other videos, is the Matrix. This is so silver. This is a purple shampoo. I already have like purple on my hands. You can see how purple that is right there. Yeah. This is amazing for blondes. Anybody that has blonde hair or gets really brassy, this helps to neutralize that kind of brassy yellow tinge. Great for in between when you don't have like a toner on your hair or something like that. Um... It's just such a good shampoo and it's relatively inexpensive compared to some other ones and I just I just love this one so much. It works incredibly well. So one shampoo and conditioner that I used a ton was the L'Oreal Intense Repair. I don't have that on hand because I've run out of it and I've gone to Redken and then I'll probably go back to that one because I like to switch up my shampoo and conditioners. But it is an incredible line. This is L'Oreal Professional so it's only sold in salons. Um, and 
it is such a good line it has l'oreal has a special protein network so they're actually amino acids they're not a protein that can over protonize your hair so you can never over protonize your hair using l'oreal which is great because you're not going to have to worry about your hair getting brittle so the intense repair is like mega power pack of moisture i mean i I like swear by this conditioner like their mask is so amazing their shampoo is just it's very lightweight on your hair but it cleans your hair up but it's not stripping to where you're like oh I feel so dry and it is just the most perfect moisture for someone who needs moisture and your hair is really dry so again for my girls that have a lot of color in their hair or you have curly hair that is going to be one of the best products for you um, I mean, for, for me, that was probably my top shampoo and conditioner for 2015 because it just did wonders for my hair. And especially because I had a lot going on, I did a lot to my hair, and that really saved it and made it really moisturized. Okay, so in the tool category, I'm going to talk about brushes first and then hot tools. So my first brush that I have is a wet brush. Guys, my brushes are dirty. These are my personal brushes that I use at home. I know they're dirty. I, it's my own hairbrush. I don't care. You know, get over it. It's cool. So this is a wet brush. If you have not heard of a wet brush before, stop what you're doing right now. Open your phone up and buy yourself a wet brush. Because unless you have hair to like here... You can benefit from this brush. It magically detangles your hair, and it is so amazing. Like, I feel like when I found it about out the found out about this, I can't even talk because I'm so excited. I feel like it was like coming down from heaven. Like, oh, here's a wet brush, the answer to your prayers, your whole life. Yeah, it's that amazing. It has very flexible bristles that when brushing your hair. Um, either wet or dry you don't want to blow dry with this because it's not supposed to be used like that but you are trying to detangle your hair it is magic especially if you have little kids and their hair gets super tangly or you just have really naturally tangly hair this is your saving grace everyone should have one of these in their house because it's stupid if you don't have one okay enough said you need this I don't care who you are unless you have this long of hair you need this so, next brush that I love is a round brush. Now, this is actually a square round brush. It's a little bit different than normal traditional round brushes. This is by Bioionic, and it is hands down the best brush ever if you want to give yourself a really freaking awesome blow dry. So, the reason why it's amazing is because, even though it's weird and it's square, it gives these little bit of angles, give your hair a little bit more, it has a little bit more tension when you're blow drying your hair. So it's really going to smooth out your hair. And I use a little bit of a smaller one. So there's one that's bigger. It's probably about like this size. And it's really good for getting your hair smooth and straight. I love doing this one because I can kind of twist out my hair and it gives it a lot of gorgeous texture. And I love it. Um, I use one of these in my blow dry tutorial and I'll link that down below so you guys can see that. It's just a phenomenal brush and it's a ceramic base kind of gives you a little bit of that curling iron technology because it's going to heat up and just give you that amazing blowout that keeps your hair smooth and shiny and gorgeous and these brushes are phenomenal they last forever they don't break down like regular brushes wow i feel like i've been talking a lot okay so this is my curling iron i mean no this is a flat iron this is not a curling iron this is a flat iron um my favorite flat iron of all time because i've actually been having a lot of clients ask me and friends ask me what kind of a flat iron they should get this is the paul mitchell flat iron um this is express ion smooth they have another one that i think is like a little bit smaller i think um this is how many i don't even know how many inches this is i think it's like one inch flat iron yeah i think it's their one inch flat iron but they have another one that has these little, like, I don't know, grips on the insides. I freaking hate that flat iron so much. But this one is absolutely amazing. Now, I have this special, like, bamboo uh, coated looking one. The regular ones look black. This flat iron is amazing. I've had this one for so long, and it still works absolutely amazingly. It has right here where it has, like, an off-on switch, and then you can change your heat setting so really great if you have finer hair you can turn it down because you don't need all that heat if you have super curly hair or even if you have ethnic hair and it is like crazy curl that amazing texture 
This will get your hair smooth and soft in an instant. It's an amazing flat iron. I love it so much. Okay, moving on to a curling iron. I was trying to think of all of the curling irons that I have been using and things that I love, and I wanted to go to something that was the most multitasking thing that if you needed to have one curling iron, what would you have? And for me, it was the Numi 3-in-1. This little dude right here, if I can get it all in. Um, it is a styling wand, and what's great about it is that it has different heat settings, your little off and on button, but the best part about this thing is, it's 3-in-1, guys. You push this little button on the back, and that pops off, and you have the option to have three different sizes of a curl. So you could do a barely there curl, which is very in style right now, just a little bit of a texture thrown in your hair, or you can do kind of the more traditional ones or even smaller ones. So depending on what type of curl you want, you can really cover it with all three of these. And what's great is that you don't have to have three different irons, it all pops onto here, and it's really easy, very, very easy, and these guys go on sale all the time. I'll look and see if there's a, like a coupon code right now, but you guys can get these for a really great price. And I just, I'm so happy that I invested in one of these and I am, oh, I love this iron so much. It's just such a good multi-use and for traveling and not having to bring as many irons, you just have to bring like the rods. It's perfect. <gasps> I'm like out of breath right now. Okay, so those were all of my best hair products for 2015. Such a good year. I am so happy that like, I feel like 2015 was such a good year. I learned a lot of stuff and now moving on to 2016 is gonna be the best year. I already know that it's gonna be such a great year. So I am so thankful for you guys for following me. Um, and I know that some of you guys have been following me for a very long time here on YouTube, and I just appreciate each and every one of you. It's so much fun getting to know you guys and um, being able to share what I love and the fact that you guys actually sit here and care about what I love and like how I love to style hair and all this stuff because if you're a girl, you probably love hair, right? Right, right. You may not love your hair right now. But if you get some of that shampoo and conditioner that I told you about, you probably will. <laughs> no, but for real. Like, I'm so thankful that I get to sit here and make YouTube videos, and it's just an incredible opportunity. I do this as a hobby, and I love it. I have a full-time job, and to be able to kind of get out of, you know, the salon and just be able to do a little bit more creative, artsy, craftsy type stuff here with you guys and do braiding and all that, I love it so much. So thank you so much for watching my 2015 hair favorites and I will see you guys in my next video and if you guys have any like hair products that you're just like oh my gosh Alexis you have to try this year let me know down below because I'm always willing to try new products I love it love it I'm a product hoarder I can't help it oh my gosh I think I just like hiccuped and burped at the same time okay bye guys I have a double ten